Olori Naomi Ogunwosi, the estranged wife of the Oni of Ife, has called out the Assistant Commissioner of Police in Akure. Queen Naomi stated that walking away from her marriage shouldn't take away her fundamental human rights and dignity as a woman. Queen Naomi promised to spill the tea as she queried if walking away from the Oni is a substantial reason to have her human rights and dignity as a woman. No woman deserves to be bullied. Walking away from abuse should not take away your fundamental human rights as a woman. What just happened with the assistant commissioner of police in Akure as a pointer to the fact that the system has failed womanhood again? Does it mean that walking away from a relationship means you should commit suicide? Queen Naomi shocked the fans of the Ife royals when she renounced her name and role as the Queen of Ife. The beautiful mother of one stirred mixed reactions online when she accused the monarch of being two-faced. I did my best to endure and make it work many times. I smiled through the struggle, but I finally realized I had just one assignment, my son, and when God is done, he is done. He chose Saul to be the king. And when he was done, he, he told the prophet somewhere, I have moved on. Religion was never an issue between us. Please refer to my interview on, on New Central TV. Instead, His Majesty has a picture he would love the world to see and perceive him as, and another one which is his true, his true self. Today, I announced the beginning of a new dawn and the close of a chapter. Today, I am a mother of God's unique gift. I am no longer a slave to my thoughts of perfection. I, at this moment, announce that I shall no longer be referred to as the wife to the only of Ife or as queen of the Ile Ife, but as the queen of the people and mother of my adorable prince. Also recall that Reaction has trailed a beautiful video of Olori Naomi which was shared online by famous celebrity stylist Lumini. It is no longer news that the former Ife queen has dumped her royal style to take on the trending stage of her age. Sharing the video online, Lumini sang the, praise of, the praises of Queen Naomi beautiful qualities and stating God wonderfully made her. The radiant queen is very different and innocent, possessing an incomparable character. Learn to live without a man, even while living with him. Our society is not helping at all. They make it look like marriage is the yardstick of whether a woman should exist, heard, survive, be happy, successful or not. Narcissists love to break a woman. They want you to beg them. They love to see a woman depressed, sad. The moment you are happy, narcissists will be sad. Some women always lose hope of fear to start from, I swear. Sadly, the Nigerian justice system does not favor women. Kabi Yesi, please sir, be kind to Olori Naomi. She is, prince, she is the mother of the prince. Prince will only love you if his mom is not under any unnecessary stress and embarrassment. Look at the situation of Femi Fani Kayode and the mother of his children. It was a serious embarrassment story all over social media from court to court thank god the mother of the child of the children now have the right to spend time with it, her children now we look back to the society where a woman is called a failure just because she she chose life over death or abuse even when walking away is the best there are those who are left with no choice you walked away just because you have support from your family you actually made a good point. This is not good at all. Just believe in our maker. It will never disappoint you in any area of your life. God Almighty will help her and uphold anything that concerns her life. Silence, even silence every voice is tearing and lifting his heart up against your glory and the Lord's anointing in you. Do not be distracted weakened or bullied into tears stand your ground in prayers and command all powers to silence them the nigerian law system is terrible the system has failed us especially when you are fighting with someone more powerful than you god bless you naomi she's an example of a dignified classy lady queen naomi 
What she went through in the Oni's palace is unspeakable, but it is time for her to move forward and get married to the love of her life that won't share her with other women. The fairy tale of a Yoruba obsolete culture that if a woman leaves the palace, she cannot remarry is a red herring. She has taken enough time out and this is the time for her to be in love again. God will continue to bless her. No woman truly deserves to be coerced, to be silent. The earlier she finds her voice, the better. I say no to bullying. Please, don't let the enemy rejoice over you. That's what they want, but they have failed. We have fallen in love with Naomi on the first day. You are such a wonderful and powerful man of God. God loves you so much. Please, don't even think of anything silly. God has your back always. Alori, one thing we admire in her is being strong. No nonsense woman and a woman who knows her rights. She was born ahead of time in the light of Niger's society. Strong, stay strong and continue to be a beacon of hope to all other women who have no person to pull them up and to know you should not stay in an abusive situation no matter what it is. You are not for money but for being God's apple eye and also to live your life in full existence no matter what if you can tell them to fuck off and walk away they actually do not know what is coming to them should they mess up with you we stand with you and say stay strong no woman deserves one percent of what Queen Naomi went through and still going through she has really tried and enough is enough it's about time the sleeping dog wakes god will continue to fight her battle the queen of our hearts we she will not die but live to continue to glorify the name of the lord she is beautiful amazing and a strong woman of god God will continue to strengthen her and it shall end well in Jesus' name. Amen. God will never allow the wishes of the evil ones come to manifestation in her life and family. The Lord that has brought her this far will perfect all that consigns her. If most women can be sensible enough to take a bold step once and for all, things would have been a lot better for them than to die in an abusive relationship. When a man has multiple failed marriages, it's not the women that's the problem, it's the man. Women, be careful in the choices we make. God help you, our young beautiful queen. May you find peace and happiness. Thank you so much for watching this first. See you in the next one.